Hello, what's up everybody? Today in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to make your USB bootable. Alright, so let's get started this video right now. So the very first thing is that you guys will need the program called Refuse. So you guys should be downloading this program from the link in the description down below. And also, you need to download the iOS file. And if you guys don't know how to download the ISO file, then you guys should watch this video. The link will be under my description of this video. And you should be able to download the ISO file. And then you will also need the Windows product key. And I will share it onto the group called AxBuddy here. So you can join the group. This is just a Facebook group and you guys can ask here anything, your technical queries. There are 7,000 of people here and they are willing to help you guys. So just go ahead and join this group. The link will be under my description and you'll get the all of the stuff that you need. So yeah, once you guys have uh, get the key, then you guys are ready, right? So now, once you guys have downloaded the uh, ISO file, it should be just looking like this. So guys, this is the ISO file that I have just downloaded uh, just one hour ago, I think. So yeah, just go ahead and download this if you guys have not downloaded this ISO file. Now open up your Rufus and also make sure that you guys have connect your uh, thumb drive or pen drive and at least it's on 8 gigabyte okay because the Windows operating system is very high in size you can see it's about 4.72 gigabyte which is very big size so guys you should have at least 8 gigabyte of pen drive connected onto your computer now after that you need to open your refuse and click on yes it should prompt for you now from here you guys want to select your ISO file just like this and click on open and from here you want to choose your partition schema okay so what this means is it is a partition style actually you can check this your partition style and you can choose your MBR or GPT partition if you guys don't choose this then it will not work for you so I recommend you guys to check and choose your um, correct partition schema so to check the partition schema you need to open up your partition and create the hard disk or disk management just like this okay so open up your disk management and then you can right click here and click on to the properties and from here you need to go to the volumes and you can see the partition style is over here which is um, on the GUID or GPT partition table for me so I will definitely choose this as the GPT but for you it might be on the MBR so make sure to choose your uh, partition style in a correct format okay so once you have choose the format then you can rename your uh, label or your thumb drive it's called Windows 10 and once you guys are ready then hit on to the start button and it should prompt you as your warning data so you must back up all your pen drive data before you're going to proceed this so press an ok so guys this will take some time so you need to wait for at least 10 to 15 minutes I guess so because it is very big file that you guys are copying the ISO file so you need to sit back relax and have some coffee and enjoy so now once you have done this now it should be just popping up like the important notice must disable the secure boot now you can close this out and you can use this pen drive as the bootable usb and yeah that's all so hope you guys enjoyed this video hope it helped you so if you guys think this video was helpful then make sure to leave a thumbs up to this video and i'll see you guys next time till then peace out